Hi, my name's Dave Stern, and I've been working in urgent care for over 25 years. Over and over again, I've heard providers ask me the same question. Would it be possible to make an EMR that would simply get out of the way and let me take care of patients instead of spending all my time documenting on the patient chart? Well, Practice Velocity has heard that request, and Practice Velocity has answered, yes, we can do that for you. We've created the chartlet functionality that allows you to do almost all your documentation of a patient visit when it's a routine patient visit from a single screen. So let me show you how that would work. For example, I can see here in this clinic that Mary Michaels has come into the clinic. She has a sore throat. She has a little bit of a fever of 100.2 and I can see there's a strep screen that's been completed. I know that strep screen has been completed because that strep screen is in yellow. If it was in red, that would mean it was only ordered. If it was green, it would mean that not only are the results in there, but it's already been reviewed by the provider. In this case, though, it's in yellow. I know that the test, the test results are in there, and I simply open the chart. Now, when I walk into the room with Mary, I can see that Mary already has a sore throat. She's had it for three days, and it's constant, and she rates it as an 8 over 10. That's already been documented in the triage note by the nurse. So all I have to do is confirm that with the patient. It is important to understand I need to document the HPI because CMS has said it's only compliant for the physician to do the HPI. It's not okay for them simply to confirm it. So I go in to Mary and I say, oh, I understand Mary. You have had a sore throat. It's been going for three days. It's constant and you rate it as an eight over 10. And you say that sore throat is, would you say it's sharp or dull? And Mary says sharp. I have now completed the HPI with just a few clicks. Now, I go to the chartlet screen. The chartlet is fully populated with the history of present illness over here, the review assistance here. Only the positives on the review assistance are showing. If I wanted to see all of the items, I could see that all these items have been documented as negative, but in actual fact, I don't need to do that because all I'm looking at here is the positives. The patient has a fever as the only positive in the review of systems, and the highest temperature recorded at home was 101.2. The past family social history on the right side of the screen is all documented. I can see the patient is a type 2 diabetic. She's on glibiride. She's a police officer who dr only drinks moderately. All of that information has been documented by the nurse. At a glance, I can see that, click on provider review all, and I've now completed the past medical family social history, the review assistance, and I put in the HPI with just a few clicks. I'm on the chartlet screen. I document the entire uh, physical exam is normal. And now that I've documented the entire physical exam is normal, I just go in here to the pharynx and document maybe that the tonsils actually have no exudate, but they're red and moderately swollen. Those are just a few clicks. I've saved that out. I go over here and I see the strep screen is positive because I see the plus in the yellow box. I click on that with one click. And you can see that one click changes the box from yellow to green, indicating that it's been reviewed. I make a diagnosis of strep pharyngitis, mark, mark that there's no workup plan, and I did prescription drug management. I want, maybe want to give the patient a, work, a note saying the patient could be off work and return to work next Monday. And once I've entered that, I'm ready to do my e-prescribing. I simply launch the prescription window, pick my doctor's list, go down on my doctor's list to the specific uh, the medication that I want to prescribe. In this case, I've preset penicillin 500 milligram tablets, two tablets by mouth, BID number 10. One click, I've got that prescribed. I review it just to make sure that I haven't missed any allergies or drug-drug interactions. I then transmit it to the pharmacy that's already pre-selected by the front desk. And I've now finished my prescribing in the system. So now I think you can see why Practice Velocity has been rated the number one urgent care year after year by real urgent care providers like you. You can see that the chartlet is the fastest, easiest way to chart a patient visit. And we have much more functionality that's uniquely and specifically designed for urgent care. So if you're interested in learning more, pick up the phone or contact us on our website and we'd be happy to show you all of the functionality that we have in Velocidoc that makes an urgent care more efficient and allows you to focus on taking care of patients instead of documenting in your EMR. Thank you.